We're here with Christy Mewis from the Boston Breakers. We're here with Kat Whitehill of the Boston Breakers. We asked her some questions that some fans had sent us in with the hashtag AskTheBreakers. What's your favorite place to eat in Boston? My favorite place to eat in Boston is probably Lolita's on Dartmouth Street. It's like the best Mexican food ever. I think one of my favorites is Island Creek Oyster Bar in uh, the Fenway area. It has a lot of like, fresh seafood, which I really like. So cool. it's cool. We'll have to go there. Yeah. Then. It's the funniest thing you've ever seen or that has happened to you during a game. Oh, wow. I've had a dog come out in the field, so that was kind of fun. You know? and, yeah, just like my dogs, yeah. Because, um, you know, in Brazil, you never know what you're going to get. Who is your celebrity crush and why? Um, that's a tough one because I like the two Ryans, Ryan Reynolds and Ryan Gosling. Oh, I, this is like so embarrassing and everyone always makes fun of me, but Day Harry video. Styles is like my celebrity crush and I just like can't get enough of him. Have I just gone? feel like when he's singing, he's singing to me. <laughs> Out of all the countries you have visited for soccer, what was your favorite and why? Brazil was my favorite country. Just like the people and like the culture and the soccer and... Um, everything about that place was my favorite. I think my favorite, and I know this is so cliche, but I love France. Because um, I got to go to Paris, which is amazing. It was right during the World Cup. How many countries have you been to? Yeah, you, know, you know, I counted once, and I was in the 30s, but I don't, yeah. So what is your pregame meal of choice? Mm. Um, pregame, I like to keep it simple, actually. I love just peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I mean, I would choose to have like buffalo chicken and like pancakes and stuff like that, but I guess I kind of have to stick with like chicken or like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, a banana. What color is this dress? Blue and black. He's a liar. It is. What do you and you thought it? You think that's gold? Well, I saw white and gold, but I heard that it depends on your personality. And they said if you saw blue, then that means you're bossy. And I was like, well, I should have seen blue then. So. If you and Sid started in a movie together as main roles, what would the title be? We've actually like talked about this. If, like we could have like a reality <laughs> show or something together. We would probably just call it you when we're together. That's kind of what people refer to us as. At Soccer or Probs wants to know which of your dogs is your favorite. Oh, oh. ouch. <laughs> Um, oh. they are so great. I love them both the same. Oh, wait, I got one. This is our first challenge. We're going to do our version of the NBA hoops. Player number one. Woo! We're going to arm wrestle. We're both very weak in the arm area, so this is going to be a very good challenge. I'm going to roll up my sleeve so you guys can see something. Go. <laughs> I can't let you win. Carly! Go. Come on, Carl. We're counting on you. Come on. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Pretty self-explanatory. Steve Ball. Not a foot score, but we're going to do it Who won? Yeah, you won. Nice. Yeah. Well done. Well done. Chance for a motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are in 10th and 11th. Who won? Second. No one wins. Water chug. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Here we go. Oh, yeah. Ready? Here we go. More than enough of this crap, we might as well put in a challenge. So, we're gonna have a snowball throwing contest. We're gonna try to get it through the hoop that Shannon's gonna hold without hitting her in the face. Take the soccer, okay? It's probably gonna be not throwing with your left hand. Just I'll try it. Try, Just try. <laughs> Oh! Yeah! And they both.
Northwind. Oh.